Hey guys, what's going on everyone? Today we are going to be building an Apple's product showcase with React.js and 3.js. In this video, you will be learning React as well as 3.js also how to customize your products. Without any further delay, let's get into it and just subscribe to our channel. This is Peter, I am the manager of Epic Programmer. This is August, CDO of Epic Programmer. And this is Sanjay Kumar, SEO of Epic Programmer. Hey, what's going on internet? This is Santosh Aron from Epic Programmer and right now I'm just in uh, CodeSandbox.io platform. So first let me create a sandbox. Uh, so as this is a live video, I'm just choosing this platform in order to show that uh, show the React app in multi window. Okay, that's it. So that's the reason I'm using this platform. So, yeah, the UI looks uh, pretty cool. So let me rename this title to Apple. Okay, let's uh, start building this project. So first, uh, I'll just head over to package.json file over here, and uh, I'll just uh, add those dependencies. So let me select this all and add those dependencies. I just added uh, React, React DOM, and React scripts dependencies, also 3JS dependencies. So uh, this will help us to uh, show the product a way better. So I just use the keywords in order to rank my uh, project in Google. That's it. Uh, you can uh, remove these keywords as well. So heading over to uh, uh, index.js. So what I'm doing here right here is that I'm just importing all those React DOMs react from those dependencies also i'm just uh, initializing those uh, style just css uh, file over there and in css file what we're gonna do here is that we'll just edit uh, the fonts and the body as well so let me edit this uh, style of css so i'll just import those url and i'll just uh, uh, resizing this uh, fonts also, I'm just adding some background color, just uh, white color, and yeah, that's it. I'm just editing those uh, H1 tags and heading over to app.js. Uh, before that, we'll just move to uh, public. Inside that, we'll just uh, let me change this title to Apple Product View. Okay. So I just add this 3D model to public folder. Okay, so just drag and drop that file, and uh, also I'll just edit this app.js. So let me um, import all those stuff, which is 3JS and uh, React DOM, React and Fiber, three fibers, etc. The left side you can see those all those dependencies and just importing all those things yeah right here i'm just importing those constant variables also i'm just declaring a function which is model and inside the function what i'm gonna do here is that i'll just uh, those uh, 
3D model which is Mac Mac about 3D model so I'll just uh, initialize that with the uh, GLT uploader and also I'll just I'll set the state to false so that uh, uh, it can be uh, rotated okay. so then I'll just use source effect from the style style or CSS okay so when I am uh, powering it it should uh, move to the next one just uh, declaring, uh, just placing those cameras and uh, rotation, all those things. Okay, so I'm just setting its uh, frame and its state. That's it. Uh, so that when when I click that uh, MacBook, so it should uh, probably uh, move on to the next screen. So that's what I'm just declaring inside right, use frame state. Okay. So next, I'm just returning those uh, spring events, also those animations. Okay. So that's it. We have almost completed this uh, React.js model. It should probably work. Just probably trying to get it. Yeah. Finally, I will add uh, export export default function app. Okay, so we're gonna uh, we're gonna initialize all those uh, animations and those states in this function app. Okay, so this is the main function. Okay, so then I'm in, inside the return function, I'm just declaring a, a h1 tag. Okay, so right there, I'm just saying hello. When, you're, when the screen pops up, you'll uh, you'll try to figure out. Here we go. So you get this uh, cool 3D model. When I click this, the MacBook should work. That's it. And uh, this is how you should. Uh, show your products in order to get uh, more customers and uh, more engagement that's it so thanks for watching this video guys uh, make sure you subscribe let's meet in uh, next live video